I'm back. I have made it to my destination. I want to show you this little border stamp over oh, here. But a lot you can't see from this side of the road. So I thought I would start over there. And I spotted something really cool on the roof, which I want to show you. It's a really nice little Buddhist temple here. I've got the old flower mills and stuff like that behind us as well. So I'll show you that shortly. But see if you can see where all the pigeons are. Actually, let me show you this before we move on. Hello, welcome back, Shirley. Good to see you again. The world is about there's something revolving. Keeps on turning. There is fashion, there is fad. Some is good, some is bad. And to me, it's rather sad. But it's all just a little bit of history repeating. Here's a bit of Shirley Bassey for you. That was the best my brain can do on Shirley. Welcome back, more deep. What I wanted to show you here look at all the pigeons. <laughs> They're all hanging out on the roof, which makes me really happy. So it's a really nice little Buddhist temple here. Let me give you a closer look. <laughs> but I love the fact that all of the pigeons have decided that that's the uh, place to sit at the moment. So I'm going to take us around the side anyway, because this fence blocks a lot of the view. And we're going to go and have a look at this building over here, which is the old, um, some of our old flour mills. I particularly like it <laughs> and we're in autumn here as well so there we go we've got all the autumn leaves still this one's particularly nice colors and we do have a little bit of sun up there poking through I mean momentarily <laughs> so there we go this is one of my favorite Australian trees here by the way this is a paper bark and you can peel the layers of it back. They make houses, rafts, lots of other stuff from it. We joke in Australia that we didn't need toilet paper because we have uh, we have the paper box. So I'm just a paper box. It's no skin off my trunk. I'm just a paper box. There's no skin off my trunk. And I found there's one that's been cut down over here and you can see some really big layers. It's very similar to papyrus. So you can see here's a big layer coming off and the trees shed it to heal themselves. So, um, but I'll show you a little bit more of that in a minute because I think we've got the sun on the wrong side at the moment. But we get paper bucks everywhere. There's a train coming in and a, a train and a truck. <laughs> there we go, all at once. And lots of cars going round and round about. There's got to be a little bit of symmetry there. So that's Albion train station just up ahead and I will take us down there and I'll show you the paper bark and stuff that I discovered on my little wander. I can feel the sun's come out so let's seize a moment of brightness. There we go, poking on three. Hello Mike Love, how are you? Really, really good to see you. I must sing a song for you. So here we go. I am just standing outside. Let me just quickly show you where I am. Look at all the pigeons on the roof of this temple. How cool is that, right? <laughs> They're like, that's the spot to be. If I can zoom in, I'll try to show you what's up the top. Yeah, look at that. All the pigeons. <laughs> So if any of you don't know Mike, Mike's a phenomenally gifted musician as well. I, uh, sorry, I can't share um, links when I'm doing this. Welcome back, funny IRL clips. Let me see if I can zoom out again. There we go. And we got a bus. There we go. <laughs> so. Jen Love. 
Here's a little song I wrote. You might want to learn it not for known. Don't worry, be happy now. In your life we have some struggles, but when you worry, you make them double. Don't worry, be happy now. Mike does an incredibly good version of that song, which is why I'm singing it for him. <laughs> incredibly good version of that song with a stellar video. I'll at least see if you can see the dragons here on the door. They're really cool. How cool are these? It's a really nice little um, temple here. Welcome, Pug. Welcome, Jen. Jen, I know what you want to hear, so let me see how much of this one I can do from memory. If I can zoom out. Come on. Come on, Zoomy. There we go. Zoomy outy. Welcome back, Spooky Rabbit. Good to see you. In, t in truest um, Australian style, the sun's come out now. <laughs> it's a lot nicer than it was earlier. So this is um, a really cool old building. I'll walk a little bit further down um, and then I'll have give you a bit of a closer look at this. This is one of our old flour mills and everything like that. And that's exactly what I'm going to sing for you. Woke up this morning. Smart with the rising sun Three little birds Pitched by my doorstep Singing sweet songs Of melodies pure and true Sing This is my message to you Sing and don't worry matter thing cause every little thing's gonna be alright welcome back B sing and don't worry matter thing cause every little thing's gonna be alright woke up this morning Rise with the rising sun Three little cats Sat on my doorstep Trying to catch Those little birdies <laughs> That is what cats do We love them But the little shit Everyone that's got a cat knows what I mean They act on principle because they can But hey, we love them for it It's always a battle when you have a cat But they tell you when they're happy shower you with love and affection they're the ones that train us <laughs> singing hey water map my food come on human that's why i have you <laughs> So there's some silly song about cats. <laughs> I hope you all like that. <laughs> okay, there we go. Yeah, they're digging a hole. Yep, our side work. So most of our, this is one of the things I love about Melbourne is all of our sidewalks have nature strips down the side of it. So you'll always get this beautiful grass everywhere trees everywhere here's some more of that beautiful paper bark that i was showing you before slightly better sun i'm just a paper book it's no skin off my trunk 
I'm just a paper book. It's no skin off my trunk. <laughs> I'm a massive fan of paper barks, as you uh, will see. We get a lot of them here. And, uh, <laughs> so let me just make sure I haven't missed anyone. Let me know if anyone has any particular requests or anything you want to hear, because I'll sing while I walk. I'm going to. Oh! I lost you for a second there, everyone. It told me we were reconnecting, so I do apologize if I dropped out for a second. Um, loose leaf paper, exactly. So here's a nice little. Like how pretty is that? And I find they're just like a work of art. An absolute work of art. So the other day while we were doing a live stream, someone requested some Tom Jones. And I couldn't remember a lot of it off the top of my head. But the irony was as I walked into the supermarket to hear, it's not unusual to be loved by anyone. It's not unusual to be fun with anyone. <laughs> Which was kind of synchronistic. And one of the things I love about Melbourne, as you can see here, is there's just beautiful plants everywhere. It's always beautiful and green. These ones are really pretty. Yeah, there we go, some pomegranates. Very pretty. A lot of people take a lot of pride in their gardens here, so it's always quite amazing what you can find. Um, and most of our properties are, are like this, where you'll have a nature strip, a pavement, a front yard, big backyard. Uh, they call it the quarter acre dream, <laughs> which is what most of our houses kind of go on. We've got another roundabout up ahead here, and I know there was some people that were saying they, they haven't used them before. Not everywhere has a lot of roundabouts, so here we go. Roundabout with people driving on the right side of the road. <laughs> And from memory, there's a little park around the corner here. And as you can see everywhere, like this is in the suburbs, there's just little bits of grass everywhere. There'll be parks within every couple of blocks. There'll be different parks and stuff like that. So we always have lots and lots of, um, oh, I found the sun, beautiful nature. Sun, sunshine, lollipops and rainbows, everything that's wonderful is what I feel when we're together, brighter than a lucky penny when you're near the rain clouds just appears to you and I feel so fine just to know that you are mine. My life is sunshine, lollipops and rainbows. That's how this refrain goes. So come on, join in. Everybody's sunshine, lollipops and rainbows. Everything that's wonderful is sure to go your way. Cause you're in love to stay. <laughs> so there we go. A little bit of Leslie Gore. So I'm particularly f fond of these buildings here. I draw them a lot, I photograph them a lot. So this is an old flower silo and a lot of the space underneath they've converted into studios. So it's kind of interesting. And that's the old yellow and red stone that we mine here. So that one will have been built quite a long time ago. But I always had a desire to live in one of those sort of places. So it's the John Darling Eclipse Flower Factory. 
complete with silos. <laughs> And just because I can't help myself, I'm really obsessed with reflections in water. It's one of my favorite things. I do this all the time. See a puddle and I can't help myself. <laughs> so do any of you have habits like that? Is it puddles? Is it something else? What are your little things? I love how you take one step and the entire perspective changes. That, I must admit, is one of my favourite things. There you go. The world reflected in a puddle. And as you can probably hear in the background, though I am closer to the city, and you do hear a little bit more traffic, there's still a lot of bird sound in the background. Kicking away moments that make up a dull day. Fritter and waste the hours in an offhand way. <laughs> Kicking around on a piece of ground in your hometown Waiting for someone or something to show you the way These are all in flower at the moment, well seed at the moment, not flower Let's see if I can get you some nice ones That's a bit better. Yeah, I like this time of the year when everything's falling pre-winter. So we're kind of halfway into autumn at the moment. Okay. So let me know if anyone has anything they want to hear. If not, I'm just going to walk. <laughs> Try and show you some pretty stuff. My favorite game of all catching sunlight in trees. That and puddles <laughs> keep me happy. <laughs> I was like that as a kid too. I think we all have things like that. And I love stuff like this. I love a good reflection. Good shadow. Yeah. <laughs> but we all have our, uh, have our things. So I've got another bus that's about to come past at the moment. We do have trams, trains and buses in Melbourne. So you get quite a good public transport system. Let's see if I can get you a any shot of the bus as it comes past. We're on a road to nowhere and miss the bus. <laughs> I'm not sure where it's going, but it hasn't got us. <laughs> Okay, here's some non-fence muck bit here. So let me show you this building a little bit better. All the front of it's covered in graffiti and street art now. It's really pretty. And you know, why people do this, I don't understand. <laughs> I really don't get that. It's like, you know, find a bin. Been chasing ghosts and I don't like it. I wish someone would show me where to draw the line. I'd lay down my soul if you would take it and tell everyone back home I'm doing fine. I was with you. 
Down in Acapulco Trading clothing for some wine Smelling like an old adobe woman But I was dying, dying on the vine Could see through a hole that noisy chatter The troops, the celebrations in the sun the authorities say my papers are all in order And if I wasn't such a coward, I would run Meet me when all the shooting's over Meet me on the other side of town Yes, you can bring all your friends along for protection. It's always nice to have them hanging around. I'm thinking about my mother. I was thinking about what's mine. I was living my life like a Hollywood. But I was dying, dying on the vine. So there you go, that was John Cale, who was a member of the Velvet Underground. <laughs> One of my favourite songs. So, oh, veils and misty, streets of gold. I'm in the hooks. That chilled and vine Some silken moments Goes on forever And we're leaving Yeah, we're leaving broken hearts behind Mystify Mystify me Mystify, mystify me. Turn it out with the power to make every moment come alive. All the stars that shine upon you, well, I'll kiss you every night. Oh, veils and misty. Streets of boo. I'm in the hearts that chill divine. Some silken moments goes on forever. And we're leaving, yeah, we're leaving broken hearts behind. Mr. Fire, Mr. Me. Here we go, there's a train. That was a bit of in excess. So I'm not entirely sure how long my next train is. I'm just going to wander down this way. I'll show you this building from the other side too. I have no idea what they're doing in here, but there seems to be a bit of construction work going on at the moment. It used to be pretty dangerous around here, so they're probably changing the car park. Everything like that. So here we go. So this is Albion train station just ahead here.
Okay, so let's go under this walkway. So this was where I was, um, some of the paper bark we were looking at before. You can see here all these big strips of it where they've cut down a tree. I'll try and get a close up to give you a good idea what it looks like. So it's where they've cut it all down. So you can see it's like sheets of paper. You can use it like papyrus. So. And here we go. And a passage to nowhere. <laughs> I'm going to see how long we've got until the next train comes and then I'll take you on the train with me. So these are my key machines where I can pre-charge them, preload them, just like that. There's street art and stuff over here, but there's a bit of roadworks and stuff going on, so. Yeah, I never get sick of this game. <laughs> it's definitely one of my irrational happiness triggers. Looking for reflections in puddles. And I like the fact that they're so transient, you know, that I'll be gone soon enough. And from another angle, it just looks like some muddy water. <laughs> so there we go, there's the uh, building we were just walking down the side of. going to see how long we've got until the next train comes. Okay, so I'll just show you down the other side. So we've got about five minutes until the train comes. I'm in love with that tree over there too. <laughs> I don't know why, but I like it a lot. Um, I'm sitting in the railway station, got a ticket to my destination. Child looks the same to me in shades of mediocrity, like emptiness and harmony. I need someone to shelter me, homeward bound. I wish I was homeward bound. Home, where my heart is shaping, home, where my music's playing, home. Where my love lies waiting silently for me. There you go. So this is that silo again we were looking at before the old flower factory and silos. 
It's all become a lot of uh, graffiti since then. But um, that's okay. So it looks like we've got a V line train that's going to come past. here in time for the train. So I hope you've all enjoyed it. I'm not sure if my chat's frozen, but it seems like no one's talking. So um, I hope you've enjoyed this. Oh, another one coming behind me. Here we go, one train. service to Sunbury, stopping all stations except South Kensington via the City Loop. Thank you so much, Parker. I really, really appreciate it.